Back talking Cougar volleyball with the head coach of the Columbia College volleyball squad, Coach Miller at Washington. Cougars uh, 42 and two season a year ago in the AMC Conference again, champions again. The streak that I don't know everybody's lost track of the the count. I know we've talked about it on a couple shows, and you know, like, I, you know, the streak uh-huh. is an unbelievable run of undefeated uh, in regular season conference matches. Um, and it just continues to grow, and at this point, uh, no reason to stop it <laughs> in conference play. Uh, but again, fall in the championship match, the one seed Concordia. Uh, where now do you take? Obviously, the new semester here. Obviously, your your student athletes are continuing their work in the classroom. They're back from the holiday break. Everybody's getting into that routine. Do you have, as far as the legally, I guess is the term, or uh, eligibility-wise, with practicing with any of the players at this point? Can you do you have winter practices or sessions, or how does that work with your current players? Um, we do some conditioning. I'll let them three, four, you know, maybe three weeks to get settled into their classes and and schedules and things like that. Then we'll start some conditioning, uh, lifting and conditioning. Mm-hmm. Um, some of the girls have already they're itching to get back in here. They set the net up and we're playing by themselves <laughs> yesterday over on the far court. So um, I think that uh, you know we'll start with the conditioning and lifting first, and then typically as basketball wraps up, we mm-hmm. start our on court work and we'll play a couple of scrimmage uh, maybe go down and, and play a couple of tournaments mm-hmm. in the off season. and where does the recruiting kick in for you as far as I'm not even sure when the high school volleyball mm-hmm. season is or the junior college volleyball seasons as, uh, as far as that is concerned when do you and your staff uh, kick in the recruiting into high gear I've been looking last year yeah we you know we've we've identified a lot of girls that were um, we're going after and, and it's it's a little bit different this year this is uh, uh, before Paula I had Luana at setter mm-hmm. Luana Bronco Fields and they were both four-year setters so this is a year where we're cycling out our setter and that is a very your, your position players especially your specialty players your setter and your Libra are very very important and we're gonna have to be it's gonna be time-consuming we're gonna have to find mm-hmm. the right fit for our system and make sure that we invest in someone that's going to be a quality student athlete like mm-hmm. both of those young ladies I just mentioned. Yeah, because you are going to be replacing yeah. both of those two positions. Yeah, and since I've been here, I've been very fortunate to have mm-hmm. great, uh, great success and luck there. As far as all every setter I've ever had has been an All American mm-hmm. in 13 years, so that's definitely a position we need to invest in. So sure no pressure for whoever you are, the new girl, yeah, if you're watching. <laughs> Good uh, luck. But, yeah, we need a high, quali- <laughs> high, high quality setter, and that that position is just so important they're going to touch the ball every time it's on your side of the net and um something we need to really take our time and make sure it's someone that's going to fit our system at the same time kind of joking about that high pressure but that's also the bar that's set because of the different athletes that you had especially Mm -hmm. paula continuing to strive and then Mm -hmm. that same drive and and style of play is what others see in her as a leader and they follow along and Mm -hmm. it's Oh, it's kind of cheesy, but the Cougar way. I mean, it is yep. kind of the not just with your volleyball team, but mm-hmm. the soccer team. You see it a lot with, you know, the softball squad, basketball teams, uh, and so on and so forth. That everybody yep. kind of feeds off uh, everybody else's success. We've all, you know, and and I've been very fortunate. Like I said, we've always had a very good leader in that position. You know, we started out with I think it was. Uh, Juliana uh, Godoy was our mm-hmm. first setter. She was an All-American. And then uh, Olga Benoit mm-hmm. for two seasons. Olga Correa, two seasons. She was an All-American both. Tracy Ford, great leader, great great setter there. And uh, then Luana, uh, Nicolina Rastovac, mm-hmm. and, and Paula Fajeda. So they're all in the record books here. Yeah. And, you know, it's just it's an important position, and you have to have somebody with those qualities that you mentioned. Right. They have to be a leader. They have to be someone that the team believes in and is going to follow. And they have to set the pace of the game. How do you look at junior college? I mean, you look at everybody. Everything. Everybody. Everything. Anyone that wants to come and, and be a, a true student athlete that wants mm-hmm. to come and study and, uh, you know, play at a high level. And, and I look for a competitor more than, you know, just someone that wants to come play. Maybe they're good, but they don't compete every night. I don't mm-hmm. want that. I need mm-hmm. somebody that's going to compete in practice. That's something Paula has really done. Uh, the past four years that is just incredible. Luana as well. They compete. Mm-hmm. It doesn't matter who's on the other side. If it's coaches or if it's the, the second team uh, in practice scrimmage, they're playing to win. Right. And that's that's a quality that you have to have. Right of the roll. And uh, before you know it, it'll be summer months and <laughs> you'll be uh, finding those new players and mm-hmm. signing them and uh, getting that new routine and, and uh, chiming away. And then the next thing you know, we'll be into the new full season. Well, thank you so much for your time. Again, all last season, uh, congratulations on the great run. Oh, and, and Coach of the Year. Thank you. Uh, accolades as well, yep. by the way. I don't want to leave your 
trophy uh. case out <laughs> <laughs> since Paulo's got all the room. Yeah. Uh, but uh, another fun run for the Cougars. Fell just that one match short of the national championship game uh, last time around. Uh, and again, uh, we look forward to seeing you again here next season. Great, thank you. Coach Washington Cougar Volleyball Squad. Again, for more on the volleyball team, upcoming schedules, events, and all of that, uh, log on again to the website at ColumbiaCougars.com. Thanks for watching.